guys put you guys on to my cigar of the day. Cigar for you guys down here. You can see it. It's a wonderful cigar. Uh, we just want to hit you guys up shortly. We're going to be having a podcast featuring um, tomorrow with the both of us. Uh, we talked about... Um, what did we talk about, babe, today? What was, what was on the podcast? Words before? of affirmation. Yeah. Words of affirmation. So what do you mean? What is it? What do you mean? Words of good and bad words. You know, words... Words that you can tell yourself in a negative way and then words that you can tell yourself in a positive way. Well, first off, I want to be clear. She says a lot of bad words to me. And That's a lie. I need everybody on here to be aware oh, that... Oh, the devil. Babe, please. why are you touching me? Because I can touch and The reason you. why I'm saying that, I love when she touches me. I don't want to get that confused. I have the pink eye that I had to stay home from work today. And I got it because of the children. <laughs> the children, unfortunately. She got it. She got it because of the children. The pink eyes, she had to stay home today. And that's the reason why her eyes like that. But she's beautiful nonetheless. Let me see, baby. You're the sexiest one-eyed person I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> I have never seen anything more sexier than that. I that thought I eye. thought we should get her a little patch, like a little pirates. That'd be cute. That'd be, that'd be a nice role play right there. You want to leave? Do we need to leave? <laughs> okay, I just want to make sure. I didn't know. I, if y'all out there watching, excuse me, I'm going to be honest. With it. But no, we're out here just enjoying the day. Got my cigar of the day here. Again, we did a podcast. We're going to be featuring it tomorrow. Our podcast was on um, just spending time together. And we were really transparent during the podcast, I think. What do you think, man? We invited you guys. In. We gave you guys an opportunity to see what goes on inside of our relationships to a certain extent. Um, and really the whole goal is that, you know, if you get a piece of what we experience, hopefully you can get a piece of seeing what you experience and seeing that everybody goes through similar things, seriously. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. I mean, it, I mean, it's Some funny. Some will not admit that. No, no. They will pretend as if, you know, their relationship is perfect, which, no, their relationships are not perfect. Except for mine. Uh, Every relationship that anybody has been in with me has been perfect. That's because a I lie. That is a lie. And the devil, oh Jesus, please, Lord. The devil and Jesus. And Why they all got to be involved? In because profession? you just told the biggest lie you can tell out your mouth. I'm just simply saying, listen, I'm just, all I'm saying is, you guys, the podcast was great, right? Like, we did a podcast on our relationship, and it wasn't so much about the things that we're dealing with. My beautiful woman right here, she, uh, Liza, she has a board that's in our room, right? And on the board, on the left side of the board, it says who I am, right? And on the right side of the board, it says who I am not. And underneath those, uh, that, that sentence is different words to identify who she is. One of the words that who she is is bossy as hell. The other words that she is is very forceful and demanding. That's a lie. Other that is not what's Babe, on my board. Do not touch me with that hand. I am going to touch you. And I want to put a disclaimer. Way. If I get what she has, <laughs> y'all already see it from here, where it came from. That's all right. I've but had anyways, to get it. But so anyways, it'll be all right. Now, I, I really commend her for having that board because when you wake up in the morning, if you can see different words of affirmation, it definitely makes your day a little bit better. Um, the reason why is because we all, I think, find ourselves in situations where we don't think positive thoughts or things that are positive, right? You know, I've woken up plenty of times and I've kind of stumbled out of bed and I looked at her board and one of her boards, it says who I am, is confident. And sometimes you got to remind yourself you're confident. Like, you are confident, even though that you may not feel like it, even though that you you may not, you know, be in a situation right now where you can appear to be confident, but God is able. I'll tell you that. And sometimes you have to remind yourself and speak to your situation, in your situation, to confirm how able he is. I am confident no matter what I go through, he will help me find a way. And you can stand on that. Or you can say, if you were dating a man like me, you can say, I am confident. Wait a minute. Hold on. No. First of all, what? You're, if not, if you are dating, you are dating me. Mm. So you are off limits, I am period. Off limits. Let that so be there, known. So let, let that not even be something that comes out. Like, no. if you are, no. No, we, no, 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 baby. baby we're baby. not. I didn't mean that. I was talking. Okay. So I was talking in the sense that. of like, nah. No. We're, <laughs> No, all jokes aside, seriously, though. words of affirmation are powerful because they're used in situations where we don't feel the best. We need to see the best. We need to become the best. We need. To, we are the best, right? Those are the senses. So they affirm who we are. Confident, wonderful, beautiful, sexy. Babe, why are you left mine on live? You see how I can yell that? 
I don't know if y'all listening to this. I want to talk to y'all for a second. They don't need to be hearing all that. I don't know why. She just hit me. She just, I'm not dancing. She just hit me. I don't know why she keeps touching me with that hand. We didn't went to the doctor. The doctor told her it was a, it was a contagious thing. It is not contagious. Once that she got on her eye. I don't know why she keeps touching me with that hand. Eye. And why does she keep touching me with the pink eye hand? Don't touch me with the pink eye hand. Shut Stop. Up. I ain't trying to have it. I got to work. It's what I needed. It's exactly what I needed. Help me. She can't help me. This time. She can't help me. Yes, I can help she you. Don't touch play me with me. She, I don't touch me with the pink eye hand. Stop touching me with the pink eye hand. Stop playing with me. This is what I can. Thank you. Don't. Why are we on live? I don't have nobody watching my stuff. You got no friends. Oh. She ain't got no friends. I'm her only friend. That's all right. I'm okay with that. They all left. When they seen I'm the okay pink with that, eye. too. When they seen the pink eye, they left. Whatever. They all friended her. But I'm going to stay her friend. You, you're more than my friend. I am? Yeah. What am I? Do you mean? You're my, you're my friend. You're my See, brother. She started. You're my. What does that mean? I'm your. You're my. <laughs> What's that? My partner. My significant other. You're my. I'm your fine ass man. That's right. Sexy. Sexy mother. Boy. Ooh.